Hey guys, so check this out. I don't usually make a video about this kind of stuff because it's more like private and personal. Well, I make videos about private stuff, but things like girlfriends giving gifts and things like that, not really. But I had to make a video about this one. This, <laughs> this was a gift Steph was supposed to give me for a one year. And that was like three weeks ago. But she gave it to me yesterday. And I found it weird because, I mean, that's like three weeks past, right? So, turns out it took a long time because it was a, it, what she made this from scratch pretty much. And now that I know what it is, I can tell you that, yeah, this would take a long time. It would take like a month. And I can't believe that she put this much work into it. it honestly, it means a lot to me because I think this is one of the sweetest things a person can do. And it's definitely one of the sweetest things, or probably the sweetest thing I've ever experienced. Because usually most gifts I've had throughout my life from family, friends, or even past exes, um, you know, the basic thing is you buy somebody something, right? Most people don't really make gifts anymore. And they always say the thought, it's a thought that counts. When And also another thing that's important besides thought is the effort. If you spend $2 on a gift, but you put a lot of effort into it, whether, whether it be effort finding it or effort designing it if you made it yourself, something like that, money means nothing. And I wish people would understand that. And I've always thought this. I've always thought that money meant nothing, especially especially in regards to gifts. But materialistic people say, oh, the best gift is like a $1,000 Rolex. No, it's not. It's always about thought and effort because that's showing how much you mean to a person. Now, I personally don't do things like that, not because I don't care, but because I'm just not good at it. Gifts for me are really bad. I'm horrible at giving gifts. I'm horrible at finding gifts. Um, whenever Christmas comes around or birthdays, I almost panic because I don't know what to do. I don't know what to buy. I don't know what to get. I don't know what to, if I want to make it, I don't know what to fucking do. Usually I just hand people money and say, here, buy whatever you want. Um, but Steph made me this jar. And it says on it, Matt's 365 day jar. Within this jar, you will find 365 handwritten notes from me to you that are color coded to the themes below. Every morning for the next year, you can pick one to read. And she even color coded because there's different like colors of notes inside here. And the, the red ones are like reasons why she loves me. The green ones are quotes about love. Orange ones are memories, blue ones are song lyric quotes, and yellow ones are words of encouragement. That to me is one of the most special things ever, and it is the most special thing I've ever experienced. And I deeply thank her for this, I'm going to show her this video later. Um, but this to me is really special. I mean, for somebody to go through an effort like this, especially when it involves such deep love like that, not to mention the effort of having to write down this many quotes, 365 of them, individually on paper, cut them all up and put them in this jar, and even make different types of quotes from song lyrics to memories to all kinds of stuff is amazing. And the creativity that went into it and, and the thought of what to write down, all that kind of stuff. And this to me, this type of thing is what love really is. It's not about material. It's not about words. The thing is there's words in here, but these are words that are from the heart and they are ones that took effort. You don't just say them. You don't just look at somebody, say them, and walk away. They last forever because they're on paper. It's part of, it's part of a thing, and you're, you are to keep it with you and, and, rem and remember it. I think if anybody was to give somebody a gift like this, it shows that a person truly does love you, not for what you have, but for simply who you are. And I, I love this. This is, like, this is the best thing I've ever, I've ever received. That's why I made a video about it. So, <laughs> I love this. Thank you, Steph. I love you.